Good morning, people. Hey, yeah, what can I say? Um, Paul, like my beer now. Look at them little beauties. And they're only, well, they're made in the UK. Microwave in minutes, it says. Two pit of breads filled with delicious lamb donna meat with cabbage and onions. Okay, um, I like a bit of cabbage. I'm kind of married for one. Um, that's it, frozen. What was that? Oh, she heard that. I do like a bit of cabbage. Um, a bit shy on the sauce, but um, these were recommended from Ricky. Um, personal friend of mine. Well, not really personal, because the Aha concert got cancelled, so we didn't actually get to meet him. But yeah, someone I've known for ages, and he knows his food, and he does really recommend these. Um, nutritional value is a load of crap, you know. These are about two pound odd frozen from Tesco's. I think you can get them in other places as well. Mediterranean style recipe. I don't know if it's gonna quite look like that, as you'll see in there on your screen. Probably not, you know. Um, we're gonna go, right? I'll go and heat these up and I'll be back. So here we go, the hungover review. Right, it's had it more than longer in the microwave. The onion looks, um, I oh, choose the cabbage. I would never usually do this type of re review, but um, I woke up this morning, I was feeling fresh, so I thought, oh yeah, I'll give it a go. Feeling fresh, you're still half pickled. There you go, look, there's all your meat. And actually, do you know what? The two pound for the pair of them is pretty loaded in meat. I'll give them that. So this is what we're eating. How much were they? Two pound, like I said, twice. Look, um, yeah. Okay. So, if you think about it, there's about... There's quite a bit of meat, you know. Oh, Jesus. Um... Oh, um... What's it saying? The finest frozen food by the speedy chef. Jesus, um, it's got a... Right, um, I'm a, like a king of kebabs over the years. I've had effing thousands of them. Um, it's got a... Oh, it's got some... Some spice to it. And everything. And I'll tell you what, I'm not being funny. Obviously, I'm, I've sobered up after last night's little escapades. But I'll tell you what, do you know what? If the you meat that, isn't bad. Yeah. Have you had that after a few beers? You would absolutely love it. I don't go as far as you'd love it, you know, it's not my Robbie Williams, but I say look, there's your meat, nice and greasy. But you think of things like the old Snacksters kebab, that's rough as anything. This isn't actually that bad, it's got a good bit of spice to it, isn't it? The cabbage in mum's still frozen. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Mm. They're two minutes. But the meat's hot, so. Frozen cabbage. Oh, God. There we go. I'll just give it a go. <laughs> now my cabbage is hot. Well, warm. Lucky you. Um, do you know what? Considering what you pay for takeaways mm -hmm. now. Yeah. When you get hammered, and we all do it, you know, and down here, I know a lot of you to watch this come from up north and everything, it's not that bad up there. But down here, it's like 15 fucking quid for a kebab when you get pissed And that up. is crazy. When I was a kid, it used to cost me £2.50 for a kebab. A few years ago, right? Eh? It was a few years ago. Um, this really isn't bad at all. The meat is really nice, it's seasoned. The pizza bread is soft. It's a proper bit of pizza bread. It's not like cardboard or anything like that. Um, and do you know what? Despite the fact that my cabbage is a little bit frozen, <laughs> the meat's the meat's good and the pit bread is quite nice. Oh, it is not bad. Mm. It's a bit more greasy, but seriously, I'm gonna get pissed up. Have a couple of them in the old freezer. You save yourself a few quid. It's not great. I don't know where the tomatoes and the lettuce is in the picture there. 
I think that's done a bunk, but no, seriously, um, you could put a bit with that. You could actually make this. Are you actually busy. have a look? Oh God, who's that? Oh, don't. It's, it's not red up. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Some of it's not cooked properly. But if you look at me, you have to cook it for a lot longer than what it says in the packet, and that is true. But if you look at that meat, it's actually got seasoning all the way through it. It's not that bad. It isn't really bad at all, especially for the price. It's not setting the world on fire, but it's, I've had a lot worse. Yeah, I have, definitely. Because in mine isn't red hot. Yeah, no, no, it's more of it. <laughs> Never mind. Better fries than meat in the morning. <laughs> Deli belly later, eh? <laughs> no, actually, I'll about a review later. I'll tell you what, it's only quarter to 11. The time of doing this review, and I'm looking at that alarm bell at two degrees, and I'm thinking, <laughs> lovely jubbly. But I'm going to have this and stay strong for now. But yeah, seriously, um, have you tried these kebabs? Do let us know. And if you haven't, I'll tell you what, you could do a lot worse than them. For the frozen stuff that you have in your freezer, and there were some of them that were really manky and they turned my stomach. Actually, this one's not bad at all. Yeah. I'll actually eat it again. Good, because we've got another pack. <laughs> there we go. We can go again on that. <laughs> I'm good to her. I, I spoil her, you see. Only the finest, the finest kebabs. Foods. <laughs> yep. I said in I said in Germany I'm gonna take you to one of my most favourite restaurants. Where did I take you? Golden Arches. No, 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 no. Golden Arches, McDonald's. Yeah, no, but people don't even know that. <laughs> and I had a rotten burger that pained me to eat it. Actually we had a meal each, didn't we? You had a happy meal, I had a normal meal. Mm. I ate the rotten burger, you ate your rotten burger, and it cost us 13 euros, and I thought, what was the point? <laughs> neither of us could eat chips. Yeah, neither of us could eat the chips <laughs> and drink the drink. And shit it back out quick. <laughs> Never mind, oh I. Right, enough, seven minutes, this is not good. It was meant to be a quick one. Anyway, this, I'm actually Add giving a yes, I'll and I'm recommending. Yes as well. Two pounds something in Tesco's. And thank you again, Ricky. Although every care has been taken to remove the bones, some may remain. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> Bonjour, people. <laughs>